housing complexes are going up all over downtown Durham, and that includes more million dollar condos. Yep, and the developer says they are selling rather quickly, too. CBS 17's Crystal Price has more on the condos and the impact this growth is having on the city. It's not hard to notice the growth in downtown Durham as new housing complexes are going up left and right. And among those is the Vega, a seven story building going up at the intersection of Hunt and Rigsby. We're building 57, I'd like to say high end, but uh, carefully designed and I think well built condominiums. But these aren't just any condominiums, as these are 400,000 to 1 million dollar homes. I think every one of them has a, a balcony terrace. Henry Lambert is a managing partner for Lambert Development in New York, the developer for the Vega. This is the second housing property his company has developed in downtown Durham. After the Brannon, that's one street over. And I think we're convinced that this is going to be uh, certainly successful and maybe even more so. So far, they've already sold 40 of the 57 condos at the Vega. And he says it's a mixed bag of people who are purchasing them. It's not all doctors, it's not all lawyers, it's not all investors or professionals. I think it's all mixed. And these aren't the only million dollar condos in Durham, as construction is set to begin on the Novus Tower on Main Street, where they have condos ranging from 1.4 to 3.4 million dollars. And those million dollar condos are among the more than 4,000 housing units in downtown Durham that are either under construction. Or in the pipeline. Economic experts have told CBS 17 that they must keep building these homes as thousands of new jobs are opening up in the triangle on a regular basis. While some think these million dollar condos will help bring more business to downtown, others want to make sure affordable housing continues to go up as well. And as they keep going up, it also increases like the market value for all properties around. It's a complicated situation, I think. In Durham, Crystal Price, CBS 17 News. Crystal, thank you. Of course, you can find much more information about this on our website, cbs17.com.